In LMP, we are at a unique interface where we can take clinical questions and investigate them at the bench. Our discoveries are translated into diagnostics and treatments for patients or to advance and challenge current knowledge. We have strong expertise in precision medicine, but we want to enhance that by integrating advanced imaging, omics and big data. We'll do this by creating departmental areas of focus in emerging technologies, for example, advancing point of care diagnostics and phage treatments. During the COVID-19 pandemic, we've seen how vital areas of laboratory medicine are, such as microbiology. To get ahead of the next pandemic, we'll invest in these areas through targeted faculty recruitment in collaboration with initiatives like the Emerging Pandemic and Infectious Consortium at the University of Toronto. Artificial intelligence is part of our future. AI will not replace the important human role in clinical diagnostics, research and education, but it has huge potential to make us better at what we do. But this is not the only profound technological change we're experiencing in our fields. The continued pace of digital technology and advanced imaging opens many opportunities. We are already involved in many of these areas, but we can't be complacent. We must consciously invest in continuing to develop these advancing technologies. We'll do this by identifying new and emerging research involving approaches that could be disruptive in the future and identifying innovative ways of applying existing knowledge or techniques. We'll use our AI center t to translate AI into clinical contexts while also helping to refine algorithms so that they are more inclusive from the EDI lens. We're also looking to further develop digital pathology by revamping our digital media library and its use in education, incorporating more AI into the field, as well as increasing the use of digital pathology in clinical training.